The concerned authorities have begun an eviction drive to clear wetlands after floods hit five districts in Assam, submerging residential areas and forcing people to take shelter in relief camps. We have a report. Five districts of Assam, Kamrup, Lakhimpur, Darang, Sonitpur and Udalguri are severely hit by the flash floods triggered by incessant rains. In an estimate, nearly 25,000 people have been affected. The National Disaster Response Force has been undertaking rescue operations in the state. The state administration has also opened helplines for better communication with those marooned in flood water. We will clear the whole clear the water resource department and whatever department concerning the water resource department, the work ज्यादा करना है एनलास करना है इसलिए क्योंकि जो वाटर लेवल है भरोलो का मरा भरोलो का सिंसा को बाहिन रिवार का वो वाटर लेवल स्मूथ होना चाहिए नेचुरल होना चाहिए वाटर लेवल जब वाटर जब नेचुरली फ्लो करेगा तो पानी क्विकली बाहर जाएगा बाहर जाके ब्रह्मपुत्र में पड़ेगा तो इसमें डिफरेंस आएगा आज ये जो हुआ यहां में नेक्स्ट ईयर इट बी वर्स सो आई होप द गवर्नमेंट टेक स्टेप्स बिकॉज़ दिस इज अ वेरी माने प्रॉब्लम फॉर एवरीवन so, Brahmin should take on priority basis these flash floods in Assam. Assam Chief Minister Tarun Gogoi also visited the affected areas and assured all possible help to the affected families. National Disaster Management Force, Response Force, State Management Force, boats and everything we arrived. Whatever possible we have been dealing. But the main concern is we're going to find out the causes. Uh, for which such havoc has created, there may be some blockage also. Is a fact also. There are many blockages, many areas has been enclosed, even waterways and many areas. So thereby, the overflow in the waters has been blocked also. Thousands of people have been forced to flee their homes in Guwahati. The team of National Disaster Response Force has evacuated nearly 10,000 people who are taking shelter in five relief camps. Authorities said the situation has largely improved as the flood waters have started receding in few areas. The water has receded considerably overnight and uh, the traffic uh, as you can see is normalized. There is some water still stagnated in some uh, lanes and by lanes and that is being pumped out. Uh, there may be some hazards like electrical hazards still may, may, may be there. So people should take care. Every year, the overflowing waters of Brahmaputra and its tributaries destroy thousands of hectares of standing crops and agricultural lands in the villages in Assam.